Hello everybody, Pinstripe here. Welcome back to this hard mode campaign. Moving on to mission 20. Finally, it is time for Achilles Heel, the longest mission in the single player campaign. We all know why. We don't need an introduction. Let's just get on with it. This will be a game of waiting, pretty much. Waiting for things to happen because these guys are still all surgeons. And what I like to do is immediately uh, use the airstrike on the three of them uh, and basically get them down to just one pig. Get them down to a single surgeon, wait for the other ones to drop in, and then deal with the rest. And collect the medals. Because that's kind of why this mission sucks so much, because you're waiting for medals constantly. And it also sucks because from normal mode into hard mode, there is no change whatsoever uh, in relation to the enemy types. They're always surgeons. They're always the same. But the benefit, of course, of using the airstrike right away is that we can essentially pick them off one by one uh, so long as the health is below 40 or roughly around the range of 40 to 50 HP because then we can either use the snippety sniper rifle or cluster bombs or whatever. So he's on 61, 38 and 34. So as long as you can get an accurate shot, probably with the air burst down there. Just... Picking my shot, taking my time, and getting it exactly where I wanted to. Maybe detonate it a bit too soon, but that is at least the first kill. Don't even need to come down off the high ground. We can just chill wherever we are. And this guy is up next who has 38 health, so he is going to be next. And I was debating before starting this video of should I just skip this mission entirely, uh, i.e. that I kill these four guys and move on, or do I you know, do it properly and try and win. I don't think that's going to be enough. Don't think so. No, <laughs> one health. So you know he's going to heal him. Uh, yeah, okay. I was going to say, if, if a, a, an enemy teammate is on very low health, then the surgeons will usually prioritize him instead. So what I really want to do is run down there and jump on his head once, but I also don't want to use all of my air burst right away, but we're going to do it anyway. I don't care. Need to get it on target this time. Have it a little bit shorter. Drop it in there. Oh, can the extra splash do it? It can. There we go. So two left. Need to wait for the other four to drop down. There are eight that drop down in total. So you start with the four and then the additional four come along. Again, don't need to do anything crazy. Just going to get a little bit closer. Just try and drop this down. Full power onto his head. I think I probably could have gone a bit further forward, but we'll take that 9 damage. That's what this game is about. <laughs> Any damage is good damage, as I always say. So we'll take 40 damage. My commando slips off, takes 12. And you can kind of tell when the medals drop in by how many uh, medical ball crates that you have in the corner. So we still have a while to go. So we're still just going to... Chill in the background over here. We have the high ground, so we can go full power. That's still just a little bit too much. He's not dead yet, but almost down to four health. Cool. As, as long as they do something, because we don't really want them to skip their turn. So that creates another counter to start, uh, whereby... If an enemy pig, most of you guys know this, but if an enemy pig skips his turn too many times, uh, then he will eventually be gifted some kind of uh, weaponry from his enemy teammates from the sky. He'll get some air support, there'll be a bazooka, there'll be some airstrikes, and a bunch of other things that will drop down for him if he continues to skip his turn. So we're down to just Couchon, the final surgeon who will continue to throw all of his grenades and we'll just get his health down to as low as it can be but we'll keep him alive for the sake of uh, this mission so you can tell I'm just constantly going with a low angle because it's just easy from up here oh don't go out of bounds oh thank goodness <laughs> nearly drops out of bounds there of course one of the things we don't want to do is exhaust all of our supplies instantly there is of course the high explosive grenades that we can collect from the uh, pick up drop zone but that does require us to move off the high ground and of course the main weakness I find with the commandos 
is the quantity of weapons that they hold is minimal. So they tend to only have like one of each thing. Uh, so they tend to run out of them a lot faster, I guess. Uh, he is down to 118. He is down to... No, it's just my surgeon that needs healing, really. We'll just heal him up. Oh, no. So he's <laughs> he's already skipping his go, which is really not what we want. I'm going to let him skip his go again, and maybe a third time, and then we'll go up to him and try and make him do something. Because he's all out of grenades, the last thing we want is him being given a bazooka, especially as we're on hard mode. And, yeah, that's just not something that we really want to deal with. So, just one more skip turn. It actually takes 40 and 50 turns for the medals to drop down. And I only know that because of the official map editor, which tells me when the medals drop down. 40 and 50 turns. How ridiculous is that? It's just... I don't even know. Mental. Right, we're going to use the jetpack, get him below 40 health, because I don't have time to jump on his head three times. And then we'll just stand near him. So hopefully he'll just shoot us with something. It, tranquilizer, rifle burst, it doesn't really matter. Because my surgeon can heal him. There's the other crate. We're getting closer and closer to the point where his teammates will drop in eventually and I'm going to remain here to stay on the high ground he'll shoot me again and then I'm gonna maneuver my surgeon uh, near him so he can do some healing seeing as I've bumped myself back up to full health as a surgeon back up to 120 this will push me down to oh, oh come on I'm right there <laughs> why why do you skip your turn so we'll bump him back up again to 130. And I'll just stand here and get his attention. If he'd like to actually shoot me or do something. I mean, he's moving. That's a good sign. <laughs> he's running out of time. If, dude, okay, thank you. <laughs> Take your turn. Alright, there's his teammates. They are ready, and normally you'd be saying, well, why didn't you save your airstrike, dude? And my response is that I'm impatient, that's why. But we can take out the surgeon that's been annoying as hell, so he is out of the game. And now it's just a case of waiting for those medals. Cluster bombs will come in handy to deal some big damage and get their health down. Uh, I say that as I overthrow that shot just a little bit. But if we can push him, yeah, behind the medical tent, that's a good place to be. He's going to heal his teammate, of course. And he's going to miss completely. That's perfect. <laughs> Just what we want. And then I'm going to try and blast this guy out of here. I don't know if it will work, but we'll see. Oh, go on. Pushes him towards the... No, you... Go on, explode. No, <laughs> why? Uh, it's fine. He's running towards his teammates. So, if, yeah, if I can get them close together, that'll be perfect. I'm going to keep my hero on the high ground because he will be the one who will collect the medals. And that's an interesting way to heal someone, wouldn't you say? <laughs> I don't know what he's going to do next. Very unpredictable here. He's still got his healing hands out. And he switches to the rifle. So, a failed healing hands attempt. <laughs> Whatever that was. I don't know, but we're going to go in with the good old jetpack. Close the gap as soon as possible. Just make sure we give ourselves enough time. And do I go for double damage here or do I... Yeah, you know what? Screw it. We are going to go for double damage or near enough. Again, I'm just trying to get the health down as much as possible. Cool. So, have those guys next to each other. I mean, you can heal each other if you want to, but you're in a really bad spot over there. <laughs> oh, dear. So, that means that we can probably take them both out in one swift turn. We can gain ourselves an extra turn here, actually. 
Uh, this guy is down to one, 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 one. Who's gonna go next? I'm pretty sure it's the guy in the corner. So I'm gonna trank him. Make sure he doesn't take his goat. I was saving that trank for a rainy day. So he skips his go, and there we are, yeah, I was going to say, it should be any moment now that the medals drop in. We still have to wait another 10 turns for the next one to come down, so I'll just sort of bide my time. And I'm going to go for the guys in the corner, try and blow up the medical tent. Full power, that's not enough, but it does blow it up, so whatever. But they are still close together, so, oh, he's going to go for the healing. Is he going to go for it again? Is he going to be greedy? I don't know. I think we broke him. Going free, he doesn't know what to do. And that gains me an extra turn, so he only heals 20. He heals the 20 that was dealt to them both. And we're going to go for the high explosive grenade and kill them both. No! I'm going to slip off. Of course I am. Never mind that idea then. No, I'm joking. We still have time. We still have time to collect this grade and throw it into the corner and hopefully one of the kills should equal uh, killing the other because the splash damage should be enough from this distance and I think that's enough yeah they're both dead so two surgeons down two to go waiting for the other medal this guy's still on 120, so I should probably take him out. But maybe the tree will protect me here. No, I thought he'd maybe try and shoot the surgeon straight away. He's going to knife me. He wants a knife fight. And he's he's managed to body block my, my teammate. What an unbelievable play there from the surgeon. I'm going to poison him just to get his health down. I probably should have poisoned the other guy. Gained myself an extra turn. Wasn't really thinking. Now I'm scared for my surgeon because he's down to 65 health and he's about to shoot him with the rifle burst. Maybe I'll bounce away. No, bounce. Okay. <laughs> down to 20 health. Because no healing hands for me. But I guess that's the problem with having a surgeon. The other surgeons don't like him very much. So it should be very soon that the other metal drops down and then we can finish off these guys and move on to the island of Austria. Austria will be... Oh, don't poison. These guys are just doing my head in. <laughs> it's so annoying. Just... And he's... Don't... Don't you dare. No, are you... Yeah, cool. So, metal comes down. Great, fun times! Don't you enjoy being just cornered and destroyed by surgeons? Isn't it wonderful? When you're so confident in your own ability to do stuff. And then they just, they, they mess everything up for you. I mean, I was thinking to myself, like, ah, you know, my surgeon's on 80 health. I should probably maybe retreat, you know? It's probably not the best idea to remain sort of in that vicinity. I should probably heal up and then come back again, but no! I, I didn't want to. I didn't want to do that. And I pay the price because of this douchebag. I mean, th th it was expert play though from from the enemy with the body block. I mean, I know he's dead already, but I just want to shoot him for the sake of shooting. So that, everybody, is Achilles' heel. Regardless of how much confidence you may have, you can still end up losing a pig. Rip Surgeon. But we collected the other medals, so no one can complain in the comments that I didn't do it correctly. <laughs> I don't know, that's so annoying. But with that, we get a whole bunch of other medals and we can promote our Surgeon to a Commando. And if we still had that, if we had that survival bonus, I could have a hero as well. But that's going to have to wait until the next mission, which of course is going to be high and dry. But everyone has jetpacks. We will have a method of completing this mission. Probably not with the survival bonus, but... Who knows? But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you can join me for the next episode of this long-ass series. Uh, and let me know your thoughts on this mission in the comments below. I'm going to go cry in the corner now because of the death of my surgeon. And I will catch you all later for the next one. Mm -hmm.